Hey, it's me, the Jeff, and now we're coming back with another video today. We're talking the Jets selection, third overall in the NFL Draft, Sam Darnold. Sam Darnold is the third overall pick in the NFL Draft for one reason and one reason only. He was the best guy on the board, and that is the best decision the Jets have made at third overall in my life. Um, of course, that's the first time they've done it third overall in my life, I believe. Um, this is going to be a great selection. This is going to be a selection to live for. This is going to be the selection that we go in five years down the road and you say this is where the Jets went from being 5-11 and 11 to 11-5. and 5. I'm not saying that he is the future. I'm saying he creates competition. Here's why. You have Teddy Bridgewater there. You have Josh McCown. Josh McCown is 30, 38 years old, 39 years old. He is getting old. Um, Teddy Bridgewater is 26, I believe, if you have, if I'm right on that. Um, and Sam Darnold is 20 years old. Um, so with that being said, it is a big competition this offseason. The Jets training camp is a competition. Um, there is competition everywhere you get. Quarterback, five. Running back, five. It's players, that is. Um, wide receiver, 17. Quarterback, I mean, tight end, three. They're just stacked in every area of the league. Every area of the game. Um... I believe there's three kickers, too. I believe we signed two punters. Um, like, this team has so much competition, you're not going to get anywhere if you just want a position given to you. Like, they might even hire another head coach, and then they don't have a competition for that. No, I'm kidding. Of course. That's a joke. Um, so, with the third overall pick, let's review this. Um, first overall, Baker Mayfield to Browns. Second overall, um... Stan, I mean, Saquon Barkley, two Giants. The Giants pick was smart. It did what they wanted. They got the guy they wanted. Everything happened good. And the Jets got the guy they wanted. It worked. I wanted Barkley, but it works. The Jets will get a third quarterback. Um, or a fifth quarterback. I believe, in my opinion, the Petty and Hackenberg era is over. He may keep Petty on the sidelines this season. Maybe. But Hackenberg is gone. He will be cut before on the 52-man cut, um, in my opinion, if the Jets are at all smart and they want to save money. Um, I think they, I think he's definitely going to be cut or they're going to play him. You've got to do one or the other. You cannot sit him on the bench any longer. It just doesn't work. Um, so here's what I have to say. Not, is, not to say that the Jets are going to be a playoff team, but we're going to be consistent all year long. You're gonna, it's going to be the team that you don't know how to deal with because we're new. Um, it's going to be great, and it's going to be wonderful because the Jets have so much competition. Look at other teams, the Patriots, Steelers, Packers. All of those teams have competition. The Steelers in their um, wide receiver group there is so competition-related. It's not even funny. Everywhere they go is competition, 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 which is great. The Patriots do the same thing. The Saints, same thing. It's every year there's competition at some level. More competition, more wins, in my opinion. If I ever run a football team, it's going to be tons and tons of competition. You will not know if you're starting until game day. That's just the start, that's just a start um, to the Jets. Um, they need to build a lot more to make this a Super Bowl playoff contender kind of team. Um, I think they need to grab... I think they need to. I think they need to start Petty Week One. We'll see what happens. I like this idea of the Jets being consistent. The Jets will be consistent. It's gonna be good. I think the Jets are gonna end up being a reasonable football team this year. If the if the Patriots drop, I think the Jets have a chance to go to the playoffs. I really do. Um, that's early to say. That, and by the way, tonight at eight. 8.30 Eastern Time, the Jets will, I mean, the NFL draft review on the Jets Network will come to you live here. Um, that is 8.30 Eastern, once again, once I finish all my chores. Um, so, so yeah, please tune into that, reviewing all 32 teams' picks and talking the big headlines of the league, cuts, signs, free agency, I mean, undrafted free agent signing, all that, 8.30 Eastern Time. Tune in then. Have a nice day. The Jets select quarterback Sam Darnold. I like it. B plus. 
not in A because I wish the Jets would have got someone better. But I mean, it's the end of the day. More competition is is what the Jets need. That's the video. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day, and God bless you all. And good New York Jets.